Um, well, my name is Paul, Paul Chapman. Um, I'm a, an art historian. Um, subject is, well, probably the subject would be better described as art and its cultural histories. So I'm a, um, a lecturer, an educator. I, I deliver courses, lectures, seminars, study days um, and tutorials, um, all based on the idea of, of art history. <laughs> yeah, 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 I know what you mean. Um, but it, it's not, and it, and, it, and it doesn't need to be. Um, painting is uh, an integral part of, or I should say art is an integral part of, of kind of human existence. We love to hear our stories and we love to tell our stories. And, and that's what the arts do, one of the many things that the arts do. You know, paintings can reveal everything about this kind of tangled web of human existence that, that we all experience. You know, the, the, the kind of love and anguish and hate and politics and economics and social politics and love and beauty and war and violence and, and sex and sexuality, all of these things, you know, the whole width of, of, of human ideas and existence and emotions are portrayed in a painting. A painting is, is a lot more than just an illustration of a person or a place or an object. You know, it has these deeply embedded ideas about who we are. And I think that's what painting does and why it's interesting is it, it is about who we are and what we do. Painting in particular is, um, it's a mirror to our world. And when we look into that mirror, look at that canvas, more often than not, we're kind of reflected back from it. It informs us, it delights us, and it educates us. You know, art is um, so important part of our culture. Art tells us everything we need to know. It can tell us everything from this kind of majestic beauty of human existence right the way through the spectrum down to the darkest disquieting horrors of human existence and that one of the reasons why art is not boring um yeah you can find out more by videos on youtube um on the website, on social media. Uh, if you're on YouTube, you can go to the, um, the About section and there are links to social media. You can find me on Facebook. Um, also on the website, that's where all the information really is. So you can find out about the talks and the lectures, where I'm going to be, subjects I kind of deal with. Um, so seminars, lectures, study days, online lectures as well you know all the information is there on 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 my website oh god that's a difficult one um sum it up um you can't eat art but it feeds us <laughs> <laughs>